You are about to enter the Chrome Dome. All right, Chrome Domers, welcome back. I'm Old Ball Guy, aka OBG, and we are heading in for another day of GAC. So, let's first talk about last week. So, last week we ran up against blah 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 T2. I don't know how you're supposed to pronounce that. I do not speak that language. So, um, but we did manage to clear three zones, failed eventually, ran out of tunes on Phoenix back here. But as you can see, not only was he, he didn't even bother trying the fleets once he realized he could not get past Qui-Gon Jinn and therefore could not win. He got his single attack in. He came at Qui-Gon Jinn twice and failed twice. He almost killed somebody. I bet he was super excited about that until <coughs> he dropped a... Uh, old Ben down here to one, and then JKA was like, hey, let me have some lunch. So, on to this week. And this week, we are up against Underpants Gnome. I mean, Underpants, who is slightly more than, uh, right at double RGP. I actually might be like 198% of RGP. Um, and as you can see, very solid, very strong ships. Uh, very solid roster all the way around. And he demolished us. Just ran through this one shot Qui Gon Jin. One shot the whole entire lineup. One shot Relic KRU. One shot the Geos. Like, didn't even blink at these things. Just complete annihilation, which it's been a while since somebody's burned through us that far. And. Left for us on defense, a Relic 7 JKA and a Relic 3 Padme. So, I'm just going to be honest with you. I have nothing that can touch this. I cannot get through this team. Even if I had used everything in my lineup, I would not get through that. The healing, the, the counters from JKA, when you hit somebody down, just way, way too much. Um, and then on the other side, he left us this. So this is where we're going to try to go. And, oh, buddy, is it going to be a fight? So we're going to send in the Empire and see how this goes. I think we'll be okay. It's our only chance to clear this zone. And to clear any zone, not that it not that it matters, because since we can't beat JKA and Padme, we're not getting anywhere. But we're not going to win this, I should say. Uh, so let's come in. We hit him with the AOE. Come in hard. Go and pop him off. And then boom. Boom. There goes one down. Another one in trouble. All right. Hit him again. And come right over here. That's not dead. That's not dead. All right. Keep working on Alpha because that's your target. Once Alpha goes down, the rest of the squad falls apart. And it's looking okay. I don't know if we're going to get through here or not. Let's see. I mean, this is a full Relic Geo squad. All right, there we go. That's out. Now comes the Massacre to finish this game off. Boom. 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 All right. 74 is not awful for a taking out a full Relic Geo squad. Um, what you got back here looks like back row Phoenix, which is pretty common occurrence these days out here in GAC. And we are going to come in with Padme. Our second strongest group. I don't know. Is it? Is the bounty hunter stronger? I don't know. It's pretty close. The bounty hunters will be stronger eventually, with that Zam uh, Zeta in there once they're all leveled up and geared up. So they have no uh, buffs right now. So I don't want to come in with the buff. I'm going to come in with this. Oh, one shot at him. Very nice. Let's go ahead and toss up the smoke. And come in hard. Yeah. Boom, 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 boom. That one's dealt with. 
Now we can come after Chopper. And Chopper's in trouble now already. Hit him hard, hit him hit him a lot, hit him hard. Okay, that's fine. That's that's good. There we go. Alright, let's get rid of Kanan here. And this is a very not great uh Phoenix squad, even as Phoenix squads go. So loop and done. So if we could have one shot that Padme team, that'd be fun. Would have been a good fight, but I mean, another million and a half GP, or we're an even GP with these guys, that's a that's an easy win, buddy. All we need is one team to take out Padme, and there's a lot of teams that beat Padme, uh, CLS being one of them, but that's a full CLS that's reliced up as well. So, uh, let's, let's see how bad this is. Okay, so we're going to go in with Grievous, then we're going to follow up with the Bounty Hunters, and watch us get completely annihilated. You ready for this? Alright, here we go. So we're going to Grievous to soften him up, Bounty Hunters to finish him off. So the, the what's the over-under on how many characters we kill? 0.5? I don't, think, I don't think we kill any. Maybe we get one. Doesn't seem likely. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, life is funny. It's just hilarious. Oh, boy. Yeah. This is what happens around here these days. Oh, gosh. Yeah, um... Hey, I shot you! <laughs> okay. This is why we didn't come here with the real teams, because this <laughs> complete destruction. The, the, the Padme JKA Snips team with uh, Kenobi is a very, very strong. He's even stronger when you put R2, because he shares his buffs, I mean, his, his uh, health and protection and offense up uh, to people as well. So... That's going to be it today, folks. That is a, a loss, taking us to 1-1 one and one on the season. And uh, we are officially locked in to Bronzium next season. We are at 22-24. Oh, wait. Yeah, 22-24. Uh, 144 ahead of the, the, the break point. And with two games to play, we will definitely make it into Bronzium next season where the butt kickings will continue. Until next time, OBGO.